Greetings fellow adventurers, my name is Vizley Ahain and welcome to the other one. Um, some kind of videotape, video game that I found on each EO, whatever, I don't know how to say that anyway. Um, looks interesting. Also, I have to say in the last video where I recorded a, an indie horror game, I actually made myself here in the corner a bit too dark, but I realized that and it's fixed now. I, everything's good and I'm ready to do some horror. It's spooktober, let's get into it. What do you have for me, game? I don't know at all what I'm like walking into, but I am excited. Oh, where are we going? What is that? That looks like an abandoned place. There's like, uh, the, like the, the the door is barred with wooden planks, and that's probably me coming with my car to the place because I don't have anything better to do than going to a weird abandoned place in the middle of the evening, morning. I don't know. It's kind of dark. Oh. Okay, that sensitivity is bad. Can I not interact? Oh, there we go. Still kind of low. Uh, okay, that's probably... Okay, there we go. That's... I can deal with that. So, what are we doing here? What are we... What exactly is their deal here? Can I interact with things? It, you, tell, you told me the controls like a moment ago. Seven, se uh, with several wooden boxes. I remember using similar ones when I was working picking apples on my uncle's plot. Oh, those are some big boxes. Huge. I can enter or I can interact with more things. A pile of garbage bags. From the smell, I can tell that they contain mostly organic waste. Oh, but what kind of organic waste? Is it a flesh? Human flesh, maybe? What the? Someone left a toy here. Why does it smell like poop and garlic? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's a, 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 a charm to basically ward off vampires it's obviously not working because i'm here i mean I'm, I'm not a vampire and i would never be don't we don't talk about like the we the rest of the weird stuff here only about this, this creepy toy thing can we really call this a toy i don't think i would call this a toy if i saw this anywhere literally oh what's happening oh it's raining if i saw this literally anywhere a toy is not what i would call this what i would call this is an abomination of human creation. Maybe we should go in. It's starting to pour pretty horribly. Yeah, I think we should just go in. It's getting kind of dark as well. Am I in? I cannot even see. It's so dark. It's so dark. Yes, so dark. Oh, what? Ouch. Ringing in my delicate ears. What is happening now? Whoa. What, what happened? Where am I? I... Good questions, me. My head feels like I've been knocked out. Is that what happened? I would, was I bonked? It was a bad idea to explore this house. I need to get out of here. <laughs> Just got in already. Yep, we have to get out. <laughs> e. Click. Yes. F. No. Hello. It's stuck. I can't open it. Even if I could, there are bars outside. What even is this place? A woman. Picture of a woman. A dry as a bone. Even watering wouldn't help it. Yeah, I got a plant recently. And I guess because they don't really have natural sunlight in my room. It kind of died. Ew. An audio tape. Interesting. So that was a shame. Full of trash. I cannot crouch, apparently. Uh, what am I looking at? A wardrobe. It's locked. Who locks a wardrobe with a padlock? Probably some important secrets in there, then. I'm pressing buttons, but nothing really does anything from what I'm seeing. So I don't have any kind of flashlight. Solid stool. It's too dark here. I don't want to trip over something and break my head. <laughs> Yeah, because that's something a normal person worries about. Oh, I don't want to break my head. You're not like, oh, I don't want to trip and like hit myself or something. I don't want to break my head. Do I just go out the door? Nope. It's locked. Wait, I'm... What? Did I hear something? Oh, oh there's a camera. What? An old camera. And a tape. The tape is signed your way. What is this all about? There's no one here. Someone's playing with me? 
But like, it, it wouldn't hurt to take it out, right? No, totally. Yeah, totally fine. Are we really gonna sit down while doing this? Like, why not, I guess? <laughs> Might as well. Am I gonna get jump scared by something? Is that the outside? Definitely the outside, but... Wait, I can move? Wait, I can actually move. Wait, excuse me? Wait, how does that work? Wait, what? <laughs> wait, what? No, wait, how does that work? That... That is not open... Uh... I mean, that's an interesting mechanic, I have to say. Being able to actually walk in the recording. Can I pick up the axe? Like, what exactly am I, am, am I right now? Am I seeing somebody else before me or something like that? Take their journey? You know, I'm going straight for the door. No? Oh, wait, that's it's for the padlock, obviously. Jump scare? No? Nothing? Nothing gonna jump at my face and try to eat it? But it's so scrumptious. So delicious looking. <laughs> I love how I'm just jumping down the stairs. <laughs> I cannot move any faster than this. Uh-huh. It's kind of weird that I feel like looking up when it's obvious that the, the down is the problem. <laughs> right? I'm also keeping an eye on the door, like, in the real place. Look, it's very dark in here. I don't like it. I'm not a fan of darkness. I love darkness, but I hate darkness. Hate and love it at the same time, basically, is what I'm getting at. Um. Um, excuse me, what, <laughs> what is this, what, what am I looking at? Hello? Oh, what, who put that here? Am I losing my mind? Uh, I don't like it, I'm gonna need this flashlight too, though, I mean, I'm gonna need this flashlight though, better take it. That's a flashlight? That looks like a camera. Oh, such a great flashlight. No reason carrying this camera around. I'll leave it on the table. Are we sure? There was also... There was another tape we got, right? Can't we watch that one? There's another one here as well. Feels weird to watch them. It's like I wasn't just watching, but actually being there physically. Wait, you actually felt that? It wasn't just like a gameplay thing? Picture of a man. Do I want to even play whatever... Take whatever I got before... Might as well. I am curious. Oh. There is a lot of noise and static, but you hear an excited woman's voice. It worked! One step away, bringing him b so happy. Never in my life would I have thought. Achieve it. Camera and tapes. Dimensions. I was crazy. Miraculously. It works. Chance. Scientific discoveries. More tests. There is even more static and noise. When he thought this must be the end, he hear a clicking sound and then the woman speaks again. But this time, she's clearly disturbed by something. Not him. A mistake. How could I? A good idea. Still a dead beloved from another, it is not even close about our world, horrific and twisted counterparts, this thing, abomination, mimic a human, some reason, foolish, what I deserve, follow me, I can't let this happen, then the tape just stopped. What is this, the SCP Foundation? I think I just found one of the SCPs they were messing with. <laughs> Sturdy metal and it's locked. Do I watch the other? I guess I watched the other tape. Because one of them wasn't terrifying enough. <laughs> We need more. We need to be more terrified. Down and down into the deep. Who knows what we'll find beneath. A big rusty door. Darkness and more. Hidden in the basement. Store. Oh, I think I just fell in a hole. Well, adios life, I guess. Uh, never mind. I'm in the flesh dimension now. I just fell through a portal into the flesh dimension. You know the dimension of flesh? 
I don't see anything. Oh, that's big. Oh, that's big. So, it's there's a bit of metal and concrete in the flesh dimension. I would like to speak with the god of dimension of this dimension about how they are managing it because it feels like they are straying from the path of flesh and blood, and that doesn't feel very fitting for the flesh dimension. Can I have a word with you there, sir or ma'am or anything in between? Uh. Why is my heart making noises? Wow. What? Oh no, you are making noises. Not my heart. Maybe it's also my heart. Maybe it's everything. Maybe it's my heart and this. Also, maybe I don't. Maybe I shouldn't. Am I supposed to follow the noise? I guess so. Looks like I'm popping these for some reason. You shall pop. I'm trying to avoid the pillars. I feel like they, they're gonna do something bad. If I don't... Oh, I did it. It worked. Oh! What was that? Yeah, what was that? <laughs> Actually, what, what, what? And how is this happening? Whenever I see certain things in those footages, they appear on the table. The key looks like something I've never seen before. I was gonna say about the flashlight before. Like, wait, I did not see the flashlight on the table before. I just, I don't think so. This key is made... It's not made from metal. It feels like it's pulsating. I'm guessing it's for you because it's red. A crowbar. Yeah, I can bash the creature. Even though I don't know if that's going to do much. <laughs> can I open you with that? Oh. Oh, well, it is for that, actually. I thought I have to like, maybe open the main door. Why did the creature put me in here? Or whatever the heck put me in here? And now... It's like we're playing a game or something. Oh, <laughs> I saw that. Hello? Hello? The gate. Oh, oh, <laughs> can we close this? Can we just close? Can we just close this? Maybe, maybe, perhaps, no. What? Wait, I don't know if we should do this. I don't know if we should do this. I don't know if we should do this. Maybe, yeah, maybe we should not do this anyway. Maybe, yeah, we have one more tape. Maybe we should check that out. Oh, wait, there's more. Oh, that, well, never mind. <laughs> yeah, more tape. One more tape. One more tape. It's gonna, it's gonna be fine. There's, there's, it's so that it's gonna be all fine. Uh... Oh, no, I've been, I've been sucked in. How do I even get out of here? What? That looks terrifying. Oh, that looks more terrifying now. Okay, so from being terrifying, it looks more terrifying now. Awesome. Exactly what I need in life. Uh, go the right way. Never mind. The left way. I'm being chased, I think. I don't like this. I don't like this. It's coming. It's coming. I'm running. I don't know where I'm running to, but I'm running. Where am I running to? Yep, I'm hurrying. Oh, I got here. I managed to do it. I got whatever this is. Oh, no. I'm back, but, uh... Oh! Wait, did I just break the camera? Did that work? There's no way that worked, right? There, Maybe it worked. I woke up being all alone, and the door was open, just like that. Huh? I can't believe I managed to exit the house. Nothing and no one stopping me. Really? Did we, we, did, we did it? Trauma of these events haunts me to this... Of those events ha haunts me to this day. So we did, we did survive. My friends didn't see the change in me at first, but you can't hide. You, we can't hide with your true emotions forever. I can't tell them; they won't believe me anyway. This is my burden. I have to carry it myself. No, you have to find the SCP Foundation. That's what you need. I just wanted to go home. What if I go to that creepy? Oh, it's gone. Wait, the creepy thing is gone. Huh? The little creepster thing. There was nothing to see here. I was so tired. What if I go back in? There's no way that I'll go back in this cursed place. <laughs> oh, you know what? Fair enough. Fair enough. 
The car was still there when I left it. When I left it, I mean. It was time to go back. Back to the past. Samurai Jack. <laughs> I'm still afraid that I'll see this thing when I turn around, but when I do, it's never there. Although in my head, it's still present, haunting me every time I hear a sudden noise or have a bad dream. I think that's just called trauma. <laughs> I think you've just been traumatized. <laughs> I think this feeling will eventually go away, as well as my phobia of cameras. Oh no, he cannot ever be a, an influencer now. I mean, it will, right? But sure, buddy, sure. Totally. The other one. Alright, this was a good indie horror game. I really enjoyed this one, actually. Game made by Tobias M. Well, check out Tobias M's games. They are very good. Like, as a concept, like, being both inside the, like, you know, the room and inside the tape. And being, like, some kind of weird portal thing. Really cool. And this might be the first time I see, uh, like, horror game protagonist doing something smart. Oh! I meant to say something smart, which is breaking the camera. When he realized that it's all bad. But alright, I guess one of the creatures did manage to slip into our own reality or something like that, because it's obviously there. <laughs> so that's not very good for the human race, but... Good game. Good game. Really, really fun. I enjoyed it a lot. Here we go. And... Even the monsters really look really creepy. So... Thank you for watching this video, and if you enjoyed watching it, punch the like button with everything you have, and have a great day or night. That's for now, farewell, and bye bye.